He is known for being a British writer of young adult fiction and children's novels, specializing in dark fantasy, suspense, and supernatural thrillers. His books often feature battles against malevolence, with the help of supernatural guardians, fairy hordes, and time-traveling teddy bears. Recognized for his genre-busting and original storytelling style, his name is Robin Jarvis. In the world of young adult fiction, one name stands out, Robin Jarvis, a British novelist known for his dark fantasy and supernatural thrillers. Jarvis has captivated readers with his gripping tales of suspense and malevolence. His books take readers on thrilling journeys, from a coastal town battling evil with the help of a supernatural guardian, to a dystopian future where a sinister book triggers a world-switching phenomenon. One of Jarvis' most beloved series is The Deprit Mice, which features anthropomorphic rodents and small mammals, particularly mice. Set in London, specifically in Deptford and Greenwich, these books have captured the imaginations of readers young and old. In fact, Jarvis's debut novel, The Dark Portal, featuring the Deptford Mice, was a runner-up for the prestigious Smarties Book Prize in 1989. Jarvis's writing has been described as genre-busting, with original and spooky elements that blend psychological horror and modern twists. Although he doesn't consider himself a horror writer, his work has drawn comparisons to the likes of Stephen King, but for young adults. His ability to create atmospheric and gripping stories has earned him a dedicated following. In the small town of Whitby, something dark and ancient is stirring. This is where our protagonist, Robin Jarvis, returns in his greatest literary achievement, bibliography, The Witching Legacy. The series, consisting of four titles, The Power of Dark, The Devil's Paintbox, Time of Blood, and Legacy of Witches, takes readers on a thrilling journey into a world of supernatural vendettas and ancient curses. In The Power of Dark, we meet two friends, Lil and Vern, who unwittingly become entangled in a supernatural battle from the past. As they navigate the eerie town of Whitby, they soon realize that ancient forces are at work, threatening to revive a long-lost magical artifact. With the help of Cherry Cerise, the last of the Whitby witches, Lil and Vern must confront the darkness that lurks beneath the surface. Continuing the adventure in The Devil's Paint Box, Lil finds herself in even greater danger. As she discovers an antique box of watercolor paints, she unknowingly releases malevolent entities with each stroke of her brush. Meanwhile, Vern and Cherry Cerise are preoccupied with unraveling the secrets of the Golden Nimius. With an old enemy closing in, Lil's friends must find a way to protect her from the impending threat. In the third title, Time of Blood, the sinister Mr. Dark has gained unprecedented power and has enslaved young Vern. Lil, determined to save her best friend, faces insurmountable odds. With the help of unexpected allies, including a witch, a mysterious man of many disguises, and the secret of off-waiters beneath the cliff, Lil tries to thwart Mr. Dark's audacious and insane plan. But Whitby has become an ever more terrifying and treacherous place, where the restless dead refuse to find peace. As Robin Jarvis weaves his tale of suspense and danger, Whitby itself becomes a character in its own right. The town's rich history, stretching back over a thousand years, compels stories out of Jarvis. Each step taken on the 199 steps of Whitby leads to a discovery of dark and grave secrets that have remained hidden for centuries. Join Robin Jarvis in his greatest literary achievement, bibliography, the witching legacy, and embark on an unforgettable journey through the streets of Whitby. Brace yourself for a thrilling and chilling adventure that will keep you on the edge of your seat until the very last page. Do you want to explore more novelists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.